Hi everyone, I'm Patricia Nicole, also known as Painted Hair on Instagram, Wella Professionals Brand Ambassador, and I'm here with my lovely model, Megan. I'm gonna be doing a face framing tease light application just to give her some brightness around her face. I'm also gonna be using Blonder Plex from Wella. It is an amazing tool that you can use to help eliminate a lot of your breakage, but still give you a lot of brightness and even lifted results. So I'm so excited for you guys to see what our hair is gonna look like. I'm gonna use Blonder Plex with Willoxin Perfect 20 volume. And the reason I'm choosing 20 volume is because I'm gonna be lightening the hairs around her face. So slow and low is gonna be the best way to get her the results that I want to get. With Megan, I'm gonna use six foils to create maximum brightness and lift around her face. So as you can see, I'm gonna go in in a horizontal section and then I'm gonna go around the sides of her face, frame them perfectly and use two foils. It's really important to make sure that the amount of hair that you pull or section to give the face framing highlight is thin enough that you can split in half. So now I'm gonna go in and I'm gonna take this side and roll it up and then I'm going to pin it away. And now the amount of thickness that I have right in the front, I'm gonna carry over to the side of her face. And this is going to be the hair, as you can see, it's super fine. I'm gonna go in my nice cheese section, clip those little baby hairs out of the way, and then I'm gonna go in and I'm gonna foil this part. And then I'll lay a little bit of lightener right on top and go in and lay the hair down right on top of that foil. And then I'll sandwich that hair and bring it down to where her blonde ends are. So that's the part I'm gonna work on first, is just making sure that I get all of the lightener pushed down and I'm getting most of the dark parts of her hair covered. Of course, excluding her ends. So now that that's done, I'm gonna straighten out my foil, pull my ends out, and then I'm gonna go in in a tri-fold and seal that foil closed. And this panel, I'm gonna start a lot lower Tease that just like this. So it's almost creating like mini baby lights. My goal is to get a smooth transition area between her face framing and the rest of her hair. So now I'm gonna go in and mimic what I did in the bang, except for I'm gonna take this section into a diagonal and split it right in half. So now that I'm finished with her application, I'm gonna allow her hair to process and I'm gonna be checking her foils frequently until she's all finished. Now that I'm finished with her process, I'm gonna go in with step number two. It's extremely important to remember to always use it because this is the bond stabilizer and this is a part of the service that you don't wanna miss out on. Thank you guys so much for watching Megan's transformation using Blonderplex and Wellaplex step number two. I had such a great time with her today and even though I used six foils, I was able to achieve maximum results. Make sure you guys try this technique at the salon and let me know what you guys think. You can find me on Instagram under Painted Hair. Thank you for watching.